Hey everyone, it's Selena here at Amore Fabrics. I'm here in my kitchen messing with these Reader's Digest um, journal book cover kits that I'm putting together for you. I'm not sure that was a mouthful. I am not sure what I'm gonna call them yet. But pretty much I can see here what I got going so far. Um, I've been putting together um, the these little ring posts here for the spines for your guys' tassels or it just looks really cute just there. Um, so I'm attaching those. So I figured tomorrow, um, I'm going to hope for the first time in a long time going live to put them on and you guys can join me. Comment down below what you think. <clears throat> if not tomorrow, maybe Monday, what do you think? I'm not sure. But so what I'm doing is I'm attaching these to the spine. And these guys, um, the cover plates are not attached. I'm just using this to show you guys as a display. It'd be put into the kit to where you can put it where you want it, how you want it, if you want to layer something on it what have you, and maybe you may not want the faceplate at all, but I'm gonna leave that up to you, who, whatever kit you decide to get. I'm just showing this as display. I have the hitch post put on. I also have, um, not all of them, I'm, this is the ones I have so far. I've reinforced the spines um, of most of them. The hitch post is put on. If you probably wanna know what a hitch post is, it's the post on the cover um, to where you put your, down below here, I'll show you. I wonder if I have one. Let me get one in the other room done. I'm working on my daughter's. She, uh, I'm working on hers for our trip. And let me go grab it really quick. Hang on. Okay, these are the ones I have for my daughter and I. We're going to Canada the, this fall. And this is the one I chose. I figured um, I can put it together and show you guys how I put mine together. My kit, I guess you can say. Each one of these kits, um, each book that you choose, say whatever book cover you decide to choose, um, we'll have 60 pages. So then each, you can put three signatures in each um, cover. Um, we'll give you 10 pages, well, actually 20 pages if they're folded in half um, per signature. Um, I hope that hope that made sense. <laughs> it made sense to me, but it will have uh, 60 pages. So then therefore you can have 120 pages, which will be three signatures per book to where you can work with this album as, as well. So I'm going to be using the same kit for these two for myself and my daughter. My daughter, she chose this cover um, right here will be her. She wanted the black faceplate. Um, and then we're going to put in there Canada or whatever. Um, but I really got her book to show you because I had finished her. She's got her spine reinforced. Um, but the kit, what will be complete for you when you get the kit, we have the faceplate, the hitch post we put on. I will have the, the ring. I forgot what that's called. I think it's the name. So when I do the actual video, I will be saying it correctly for her tassel. I'll be bringing some charms. Um, it's her first time going out of country. So I was hoping to put together some charms and stuff to where she can make her own dangle um, to attach to this. But in the kit, you will be getting two different types of rubber band, uh, will be black or white. So therefore you can choose if you want a white strap or black strap. I'm not attaching them to the covers because what if you have a chunky journal that you're making? I didn't want to limit you on your space of your rubber band. So each kit will have a white strip and a black strip rubber band. And then the, the plate here that will, it's a fixture. I don't know what it's called too. I got to get the name of it. Um, that that kind of binds it through the hole and the hole here that you'll see when you get your journal cover kit, you'll have um, a hole already drilled and they're ready to go. It goes right in there really nice. Um, and you can slide it right through and then you put that little crimp. I think it's called a crimp. You can see on the opposite side. But you can adjust the size you want depending on the thickness you want of this journal. Hers, I'm not putting it too thick. I'm putting three signatures in these albums for her um, and myself. I just absolutely love that. It kind of reminds me of mushrooms almost. I don't know. But um, so then she can work with it. So on our trip, we can put our stuff in it as we go along on our trip and have it completed when we're done. And when I get back, I will show you mine when it's all complete. Well, back to the kits. So you kind of have an idea. So each kit will have the faceplate. Obviously, these things will be attached to, like I said, um, you will have, it'll be a finished. I will have it already bound for you. So all you have to do is tie in your signatures, which is awesome, right? That saves you a lot of work. And then I will have, like I so said, the rubber bands and the the crimp, um, I guess that's what it's called, in each kit. And then, of course, like I said, 60 pages, uh, which folded in half would be 
120 correctly. Correct me down below if I'm wrong. I'm just kind of randomly throwing out there what it is. But all I know is it'd be 60 pages to be here. Give you an idea too. I found these really cool pages on Amazon. They look like coffee dyed papers, but they're computer sized papers. That's my kitty cat, Caitlin. She's my elderly cat. She always uh, cries for me to, to take her and pick her up and put her in bed. She's sweet. But they're double sided, see? So no matter which side. So this would be like one of the, you'll get three, you'll get three for six. What was it? You get three in each kit. Um, so it'd be one per signature. Um, so I was hoping to do three different kinds in each. Anyway, so that'd be that, included all kinds of other papers. But I'm working on this. I would like to do, um, go live. Comment down below. That's the reason for this video, is to show you where I'm at so far. But I like to go live to complete these. And I can show you guys how I put the posts in um, and um, and all that. So comment down below what you think. I haven't done a live in a long time. I would have to set up my camera. Literally, guys, it's been at least two years or so. What, COVID time? Um, I just kind of just stopped doing lives. Um, a lot of things have changed since then, right, guys? So this is what I have so far I'm working on, and I would like to work with you guys. I was hoping to have these done by this weekend, but I am taking my time, as you guys can tell. Um, I, I run a business, too, so it's kind of tough to get to play like this with these. I'm putting more time into it than I you know, want, you know, should, I guess, but I want to make them perfect. You guys know me, those who follow. I, I have a thing about perfection. I want it just done right. And uh, so far, so good. Comment down what you think. I love to hear what you have to say. Um, I'm up for corrective criticism. <laughs> That's fine with me. That's how I learn, right? Um, let me know. And and also comment down below what you think you would love to have in this kit. I want to just really, my main goal for this kit, um, if I step back and really think about what my goal for this is, my main goal for this kit is for those who really don't, are limited time for doing their cover. Covers take a long time. I've learned that as I've been doing any type of journaling that I've done. It's a lot of work, but it's for those who just want to grab a kit. You have all the pages. Um, you have the book cover ready for you. The spine's reinforced ready for you. All you have to do is tie in your signature and have fun and doodle is my goal. So your convenience, I guess is what I'm going to say. And then these really cool collectible, collectible Reader's Digest covers. I mean, look at the colors. They're just gorgeous. I love Reader's Digest. Perfect size uh, for your travelers or for whatever you're doing, doing like Christmas or what have you. But like I said, I'll be working on my daughters and I. She got the green one. I have this one for Canada. And to be quite honest, this is what truly inspired this kit. I thought, well, if I'm going to work on one, I might as well, instead of teasing you guys what I'm doing and how I'm doing it, I have them ready and available. I think I'm going to have like 75 so I'm hoping, like I said, I was hoping to have it done this week. Um, but um, as you guys can see, it's a lot of work. And it's fun to me, and I want to enjoy it as I can. I'm going to have this hardware in the shop for you guys when I do post them to where you guys have the convenience of having these. I'm actually thinking about doing um, like a matching set. It's like the gold post. Sorry, my nails are terrible working on this stuff. My nails look terrible. I was thinking about doing the post, the hitch post, this little ring thing, the face plate, a set of four, like uh, in gold and in the black, um, like a variety pack, or just sell the hardware by itself in like a four, six, or eight pack for you guys. Comment down below what you think is best for you guys as well. And then I'll just post a listing for that so you guys have access to, say, if you just want the face plates or um, hitch posts and stuff like that. I'll have it already, readily available in the shop as well. So, okay, guys, I'm going to get right at this. Comment down, down below. Like I said, there's a lot of things I said comment down below for. But like I said, if you want me to go live, if you don't want me to go live, if you want me to do a video showing you how I'm doing it, I can do that as well. Obviously put my phone in a tripod so I'm not making you dizzy. Well, it is the weekend, so I'm going to be working on this either way. Um, I hope you guys have a blessed weekend, and I'm excited on how this is turning out. I really wanted to do my own coffee dyed papers, but Amazon made it convenient to where I don't have to. It's the time factor. I wish I had more time. Um, if I didn't have to run a business, <laughs> I would be putting so much more into this. So, all right, guys, I'm right at it. I'm going to have fun doing this. I'm so excited. You guys have a great weekend. Bye.